Western Rivers Cup is a cricket carnival we've had going for two seasons and uh, the Merritt team has been selected from those carnivals and we've been training in preparation for a match against the Queensland Empire team tomorrow. Two years ago I went up to the swim tournament they have up at uh, Toowoomba every year. So it's an eight-a-side comp and then from that comp they pick a Merritt team at the end of it kind of stuff. And then after that, because you don't have anything on, so I come up with the idea of, well, how about we bring the boys down to play against the Imparja Cup team to, uh, that has to, to travel to Alice Springs for the Imparja Cup as a warm-up game for the lads. And that way that gives swim boys a, a good opportunity as well to come in and play on perfect conditions. What we did, we started on Thursday. All the boys got together Thursday night. We had a game in Toowoomba, uh, playing against the combination uh, West West team. The boys did really well in, in the game. They actually won that one. Good opportunity to bring them all together, have a look to see how you know where we can put them in the batting and bowling and all that. And the boys come together, um, gelled pretty well. And then on Friday we, we all come down to Brisbane here and we had a net session at uh, Albion on the, on the turf wickets. I mean, it was great just uh, being in that in that area just, uh, at Allen Borderfield for the boys. Um, opportunity to get down and. Uh, to have a hit and, uh, and have a bowl on, on, on top, top wickets. Today we're at the National Cricket Centre in, at Albion in uh, Brisbane. Fantastic facility. The boys have had a bat and a bowl this morning in preparation for the game. We've worked on uh, their bowlers on their lines and their lengths. The batters watching the ball, making good cricket shots. I'm a bowler so I was working a lot on bowling and what I'm going to do tomorrow, so get the right lengths and lines and execution right for tomorrow and try and practice as much on that so I can get it right tomorrow and hopefully go well. It was a great opportunity in there to use the net, net facilities and also uh, and get in and uh, the boys were able to use the pool and um, all the ice baths and all that so it's it it an opportunity for the boys to actually um, see what it's like at top level and what the top international players have to do. From Mitchell and Toowoomba like coming down we haven't really had much <laughs> facilities out there really. Like the quality of them, but come down here and get the chance to train in these, knowing that the Australian cricketers and Queensland and the World Cup coming up, all the international players that will be training here as well. It's just a great chance to be a part of it. They're all really keen, raring to go, it's, and it's a great opportunity for these guys. Um, you know, they're all from all parts of southwest Queensland. Good mix of guys, good mix of age ranges, good mix of experience and youth as well. Pretty happy with, with the boys of how they played today. We had a plan just to keep the ball up, basically just keep it up and on the stumps and uh, to restrict the runs. But unfortunately at the end there we just fell a little bit short with a couple of big hitters, but overall it was pretty happy with the boys. Yeah, it was pretty good. Um, look, we didn't come away with the win, but we were very competitive, which was I'm very happy with the boys. It, it's just early stages now of the particular fixture. In saying that, as I say, the Swin boys have improved a hell of a lot on uh, last year as well. Yeah, it, it was a good hit out for the Imparja boys, which, which is what I wanted. For some of the young blokes, it gives them an opportunity to engage where they're at and um, what they need to do and take back home what they need to do to get, get into the Imparja team. It always is competitive and the good thing about it is after the game, you can always have a beer with them or have a laugh with them and yeah, it's good. It gives the guys an opportunity to catch up with old mates again, play together again and have a challenging match against the Imparja team. For the boys now, they head back to their homes. So hopefully for next year, we'll get a few of the guys in the club cricket. A few of the guys have been talking about that the way they played here, it, it, it's given these guys an opportunity to go back into their club cricket and given them a belief that they can actually do it as well. So, and the things that they've learned over the four days that we've been here as well, they take with them for the next cricket season. And hopefully that gives a, a pathway for the boys to go either into Imparja or into um, club cricket.